box shape right down the middle, no curve whatsoever. Let's see how far it gets up there. Definitely much better struck than the one he did on the 72nd hole. Well, as if we could add anything more to the situation, Akshay Batia has asked for some training help here. Somebody to come out and check out his left shoulder. This was what he was doing just after he finished the birdie in regulation. There's his fiance Presley watching him kind of work out that left shoulder. And this was just walking up just now. He also was shaking it out. And I know that John Wood has been with Batia all day long and really hasn't seen any kind of evidence of this until now, would he? No, I have not seen one amount of, of flinching or rubbing or anything at all. So I think it must have happened either after the putt in celebration or I don't know. I just never saw a thing all day. So McCarthy is away and it looks like Billy Ray Brown that he is in definite layup territory. No doubt he's uh, going to be right over 300 yards. The ball sitting down in that right hand rough. He's going to be definitely forced to lay this up. There's Ken Tackett, PGA Tour, still right close by Batia as the ask for somebody to come out and check him out was made. Well, it's going to be interesting, Dan. If, if Denny lays it up, does Akshay wait for his trainer? Or how much time does he have? And Woody, how far does Akshay have, just to kind of give us an idea? He can go with a helping right to left wind. He has 270 front and 281 in regulation. So it is an option. And the, uh, and the ball itself, it might squirt a little bit here. Trying to actually gauge a yardage is going to be difficult. It came out low and hot. It's going to probably chase up, though. So with a layup there for McCarthy, you saw Batia exchanging a slip of paper there with Ken Tack of the PGA Tour. That was Akshay giving Ken his trainer's telephone number. So Akshay's going to keep playing here, but he is requesting some assistance from his guy to check him out at some point on this first playoff hole. Right up that right side, similar to his last shot. Yeah, especially with a layup by McCarthy, it's not a time to be going for it. No, definitely not. That's, that was the right decision. You saw him take his hand off of the club after, but still twirled it. Let's keep tying holes. The longer this thing goes, the worse that shoulder is going to get. Now, we were wondering if perhaps that, that left shoulder was injured by celebration, but just don't think there was any wincing there and that really wasn't a crazy fist pump that you would think would cause it again we're just guessing but you just hadn't seen anything like it all day long yeah somehow he's uh, he's hurt his shoulder so they're looking for his trainer and we just found his trainer and he says he needs some tape so he needs to be taped up on the shoulder and he's going to try to do it while he's walking up We believe that is the trainer right there. Yeah, he's caught this one a bit heavy. Oh, oh my goodness. goodness. Of all the things. You know, his wedge game today has not been that great. If you had to look at one part of his game. What a time for this. Of all the times that this could happen after what he's done to just come up that disappointingly short. I feel like this would take you more out of rhythm than anything. It's just 85 yeah, yards. I agree. I would want to go. And I, I just spoke with Ken Tackett, and he said, Akshay said it, he felt like it did happen during that celebration. That fist pump jarred something loose. Hmm. Didn't look very big, but apparently that did it. <laughs> Where can we go so he can take my shoulder without everyone looking at me? Pardon me. Just Where's the simple product? Just in mind. Yeah, because I need to take this shirt off. Yeah. Um, we, could, we could go over here out of the way. I'll let television know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Akshay is asking where he can go to get his shoulder taped out of view of everyone. And Smiley, I'm completely with you. I don't know how badly it hurts. 
but I think I would want to stay in rhythm and hit this 85 yard shot right now. Especially after us just watching him hit a perfect driver and a five iron. So when you think he had seen it all with McCarthy's finish and then what he just did with his third shot, Batia taking a timeout to get taped up. So Batia has emerged from getting taped up by his trainer and now is settling right, in with his third right shot. Kurt Smiley, okay. you think this was kind of a mistake on his part? I mean, you're looking at it from where you are now. I do. I feel like, and even a fresh tape job, it's going to be a little bit tight. 85 yards, 93 to the top of the tier behind this pin. Flying it past the hole. Well, I think it all worked out. Sure did. And for more on the shoulder situation of the teal, let's check in with Damon Hack. All right, Dan. Oxley just got his shoulder treated by a physio named Akihito Tajima. He's the former NBA medical director of the Orlando Magic. Oxley's shoulder came out on the fist pump on the 72nd hole, and that is why he asked for treatment, Dan. So it was partially dislocated, Damon? Is that what you're saying? The shoulder came out on the fist pump. Oh, my God. Just when you think you've seen it all. Unbelievable. So, I mean, he was adamant that he, he got that shoulder taped up, so maybe it was in a situation where he thought it could maybe come loose on him on a swing or something. And Denny McCarthy hitting it in the penalty area had all this time to think about the mistake. And Akshay now in a position to win this golf tournament and potentially earn his way in the Masters. But now he's got a potential shoulder he's got to worry about as well to even play next week. So there's just so much going on, Dan. So Batia is going to pick up PGA Tour victory number two here in the most bizarre fashion that he could have ever imagined. That drops in. And Batia is a winner again. On a wild Sunday at TPC San Antonio. He's not even 23 years old. The dream continues for Batia, who becomes just the 10th player in the last 50 years to win more than one PGA Tour title before turning 23 years old and his fiance Presley. We saw you favoring your shoulder on the 72nd hole after the celebration. You called for a trainer. What happened? Yeah, so I, this, this shoulder I've had some, some issues with. And uh, yeah, when I made that pot and I kind of raised my arm, it kind of came out of socket and came and went back in. But thankfully, he was still around and taped it up good. And, you know, it felt, it felt good hitting that wedge shot. Uh, so uh, I appreciate Aki very much. Thanks for watching the PGA Tour on YouTube. Watch another video right here.